Okay, guys, I go by the name of Illuminous Eyes, and I'm here to illuminate the motherfucking wise, okay? Um, this uh, is a love sex message. This one's going to be for Scorpio. It looks very, very toxic, but we're going to talk about it or whatever, okay? Um, I'm using a couple of different decks. The first card says the snake, competition, enemy, clever, um, malice. Look over your shoulder, the other woman, okay? First and foremost, um, I do feel like you have a reason not to trust someone, um, I do feel like someone may be trying to do some maliceful shit. I don't know if this is you or them, but it's a lose-lose situation. I feel like someone here is not to be trusted or they can't trust you. I'm also hearing Scorpio, there's an enemy amongst the group. They will steal your woman. I'm also getting the way you think is not how the how this person thinks. They don't give a fuck about you or this is you. You may have like loyalty to, to, to your friends or family, but this person doesn't or you don't have you don't feel like you have no loyalty to nobody. So you do whatever the fuck you want. I'm hearing someone here is a snake. Watch over your shoulder. I'm also getting that if you put everything on the line for someone, you're going to lose everything, everything. They're not worth it. You may be a type of person where when you get in a relationship, Scorpio, you do put everything on the line and you continuously lose. I'm getting that you have a spell on you. You need to do a spiritual bathing bath. I feel like some woman did this to you. I, I feel like a woman did some shit so you can lose everything. I'm also getting someone trying to put a spell on you so you could go to jail. Or every time you start something, you just it, it turns into a lose-lose situation. Someone hexed you. I'm also getting like someone may have like tapped your shoulder or something like someone physically touched you. Like I feel like I feel like something requires them to actually touch you or talk to you or something. Something was very clever. They did it in a very, very clever way. And I'm getting whatever they did. It, it's a it's a strong effect to your life. Could It could have been done by a, a, a by a Leo or Sagittarius. You could have rejected this person, so this is why they did this. I feel like you're, I'm also getting your, I'm hearing your senses is going off, Scorpio. You know something's not right. You know that there's an enemy or a snake or someone trying to do something to you. Someone could be trying to put you in a third party situation or competition. It's a lose lose situation. Walk away from it because I feel like there's some type of spellery, voodoo, magic, or something that's here, which I don't feel like you have any. Like you're not like you may have knowledge about it, but you don't you don't do this type of shit. Or this is you. You're doing some type of magic or spells or some type of ritual so someone can lose everything. Someone's can, someone can break up with someone or someone doesn't have nothing. Yeah, I'm hearing chaos magic. Can you tell me more for their sex life, love life? Three of Wands. Like I said, you have amazing foresight, though. This could have been a friend, a friend. 
that you no longer talk to, or like I said, someone has you in a third party situation, or you have someone else in a third party situation, someone here is definitely doing something fucked up. I'm also getting someone here is like getting hooked on having sex with you. It looks like a cancer or a Virgo. You may have a premonition that someone is cheating on you or trying to do something Maliceful to you. Someone may come clean or confess that they've been cheating. If this is the case, I feel like someone here that is that's cheating, that person that they're cheating with knows how to do voodoo, knows how to do magic or something like that. They do spiritual work. So they may have put it on the, the person that you're with or you are cheating with someone that knows how to do this type of high level shit. They may have done it to you already. This is why you keep going back to them. You're about to lose everything cheating with this person. Can I get sex cards, please? Is there some sex? It says one night stand. You could have only slept with them one night and they did this. They put some type of spell on you. Secret love. Yeah, this is a secret relationship. Someone here is uh, is um, some type of like priestess or something like that. Or someone here does work with um, spiritual work. Someone here could, you could be dating a tarot card reader that knows that you're actually cheating. So they put a, bind, a binding spell on you. It says, don't give my shit away. It says, choke me. This could go real left. Someone could be hurting you because of cheating, by choking you. I, I'm also hearing someone's accusing you, accusing you of having sex with, with someone. I feel like they don't even live in the same state, country, or town as you. Or this is what you're doing. You keep leaving town to have a secret relationship with someone else. Looks like a fire sign, like an Aries or a Cancer. It says the, the cards from the soulmate deck says the more love and care you give yourself, the more love you have to give to others. So maybe you maybe you feel like cheating is a sense of love and care or self-love or something like that. Or you need to work on self-love and self-care because you're in a lose-lose situation. I feel like in the future, you're going to see that this person is not it for you. I feel like someone here is a, like, um, should stay a mistress or you should, like, I don't know, like someone here is just a one night stand or you shouldn't even take it that far. I'm also getting something about your throat. Like, I feel like maybe your throat starts hurting or something significant about your voice box. Something here is like, like it changes. Like maybe you find that you can't like speak up for yourself these days or I don't know. But you need to do a spiritual bathing bath. You need to work on self-love and self-care right now because there's some maliceful shit happening to you. That's what I got for you.